Hello guys, welcome to today's video. Ah, life is good. Welcome to today's video. Today we are talking about the Adam Project. There's a movie that came out like a few days ago. Um, it stars Ryan Ryan Reynolds. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this guy, the funny guy, and also uh, the actress. I don't know any, but she was in Colombiana. You know any? I only know Colombiana. When I see, I always say Colombiana. Colombiana. That's all you know. Yeah. And this movie is actually a science fiction movie, and it has this time traveling element to it. So for those of you who um, are Marvel fans or the Flash fans and like the time travel stuff, this is a movie for you. Well, this is a whole other level of time travel. It, it, it's different from the one you know. Yes. Yes. So is it a time travel where you go back in time and then you create a different timeline? No. This one says when, once you go back and you change something, it affects the future that you would think. So yep. basically, if he goes back and kills his mother, he won't be born. So how does that even work? Will it happen? Yeah. You see how confused that? Yeah. So this movie has it all from comedy to the plots, like a fairly good plot. I mean it's quite predictable. Yeah. You yeah. can see the end from the beginning, but where it stands out is with the CGI. The um, the CGI is like on point, but it's quite confusing how they just jump into the action. Like you don't give us any backstory, you just jump into it. We don't know why you're going back uh, in time right from the start. So later on, we we'll find out that he's going to search for his wife. I, th I think love, love, sweet too. <laughs> mm. I think what actually made the movie appealing to us was uh, probably I I didn't even know that there was a movie called Adam Project that was coming. I just saw it on uh, Netflix and I was hey wow, there's a new movie. Yeah, and I just saw the trailer on YouTube like a couple of months ago. So you know I wasn't actually like expecting much, but it's I was like oh hey that was like a fair plot and the action were like good. So I mean why not? Yeah, so it's a good movie. If uh, there weren't that much of a hype around the movie, so yeah, yeah. But um, there's this youngster in there who actually blows me away. Like with the way he emulates like Ryan Reynolds, his character. He he actually takes Reynolds and then photocopies him in a child version. Like you actually see the likeness there, and they did well with that casting. I mean, his, his, his potential is very good. We expect more from him. Now. He looks like the guy from The Good Doctor. I mean, tell me if I'm lying, but don't they look alike? Yeah. Anyway. So, yeah, plots, good. Casting is okay. I don't know much of the faces in there. Oh, yeah, Mark Ruffalo is in there. Yeah. The Hulk guy. You know, at some point of the movie, I think at the end of it, when they were done with all the time travel and all, and then they were just going back to their future and all that, they didn't go back. They were wiped from existence. Yes, I, 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 I was actually kind of, I was waiting to see that Infinity War vibe. You know, the part where they dissolve into yes. It was weird. At like I actually thought like I was going to see that, but it didn't happen. So with yeah. all the CGI technology you have, you couldn't just create one small scene like that. You couldn't. You just had to do a touch by an angel, by <laughs> look away from the camera and then disappear, walk off screen. Nice, well done. Okay, so that would be it for today. So yeah, the rating for this movie is. There's six, six point five. Yeah, six point five. Six point five. Yeah. So, oh, we will actually tell you to check it out. It's a, it's a nice movie. But you, you would enjoy it. You would enjoy it, but I don't know. It, it doesn't really give much more than just the action and then the. Let, let me let me say this. 
a lot i mean those who watch if you want to watch movie just pay attention to the movie and then you watch it you understand it then you go away don't be on your phone doing something else and then be watching the movie you won't understand and later on you come and be like oh this movie is too complicated those who are saying the witcher it. is not nice we are what? talking to you watch the movie without last language bro language relax yes yeah, so we'll do another video of movies like that one that will confuse you if you don't pay attention bye bye yeah. like comment subscribe and share check link in the description for telegram channel bye